goss, the dirt, the trash. It's all in Amy's update. Amy and Sean, 1027 VGS. So Chris Rock is going to do a live Netflix comedy special next year. Um, he's going to be the first one to ever do this live um, streaming on Netflix. That's a... Uh, it's going to be a big event. It's going to be really, really I'll big. I'll be watching. I... And I, we went to, oh gosh, the ACMs last year. It was the first time they streamed yeah. the show. It was at Allegiant Stadium, and it was terrible seeing it live because it was for the stream. Yeah. It was for people watching on TV. So um, I hope this have we have the same experience because we're all going to be watching from home on Netflix. Well, and you don't have to worry about other acts coming in and out. It's just him. It's just him. Yeah. Just him. So um, I think that's cool. Netflix is really trying to stay up to date and, um, you know, up... And making money. Well, we were talking about this because they have the, the game show now that you can play with mm -hmm. your remote. Just yesterday. Like, just the recorded shows, It's piracy's a thing. Like, they, you need events. You need something that makes people subscribe. I'm not subscribed to Netflix. I will subscribe to watch this. Mm -hmm. Yeah, for sure. Um, floor seats to see Taylor Swift's uh, show in Boston are selling for $5,000 a piece. 88% of tickets for the show are selling at, like, the standard rate. And uh, I just think that's insanity. Bunch of investment Is bankers' it, daughters. Would you, who, what would you see for $5,000? If you if you had the money to to spend on a ticket, would, like... $5,000? It's just so... I feel like when, when you look at hockey tickets or football tickets and they're, like, 500 bucks, you're like, come on, guys. Only if I can guarantee a win, I would go to a Super Bowl. You know, Super Bowl, I, yeah. I think, is a bucket list thing where it's sure. like, no matter who's playing, you are at a Super Bowl. It's going to be here next year, and I would love to say I was there. I don't care who's playing. We got to get like on the media row there. Mm -hmm. Get to interview like uh, Deion Sanders is here. Deion Sanders, uh, yeah, no, I'm here uh, talking about uh, asper cream. <laughs> <Right. laughs> that's, that's, how, that's how the media row goes in Super they, Bowl. They I'm really down for do. it, though. Yeah, I am, too. I am, too. That's a bucket list thing. $5,000? I don't think so, Taylor. I don't think. <laughs> Only the Swifties will it's, do that. If it sells. Yeah, hey. for sure. And lastly, Jason Momoa uh, recently got a new baby pig. Uh, it's a wild pig. He adopted it. He's like, he's got like a zoo. He's got a ton of really random animals. He's got goats and bearded dragons and things like that. Now he added a pig and people are like, are you going to still eat pork? He also named it. I know. I don't know how to say it. It's L-A-U-L-A-U. -L -A -U. So Lao Lao, I'm assuming. Lao Lao. Yeah, yeah. And that is like a term for pork. <laughs> and he said he will not stop eating bacon now that he has a pet pig. He loves it so much. He, he loves it so much. One. I love bacon that much too. I hope he doesn't eat his pig and I hope he doesn't eat bacon in front of the pig. We'll see. <laughs> Details on these stories, 1027bgs.com. Eat the couch again, pig. Yeah. <laughs> see what I have on the plate?